Utah. Western Conference semifinals. Air Not ball. too many people remember that. Oh, I do. <laughs> I'm you know, sure you I do. do. I, I do. You. You know, that's right. That's right. You know, just going to bring it up. Oh, too, listen. Man. Oh, listen. Let me tell you something God. right now. Hold on. Hold on. Before you get. Trust me. I'm on your side here. You shot an air ball in regulation. You shot two air balls in overtime. And guess why? Everybody else was sitting there crucifying you. This is what I was thinking. Dell Harris started this man just six games that season. Why is this rookie in that position? Especially when there was friction because you wanted more playing time and you felt you deserved more playing time. So I'm like, why were you in that position to begin with? What were the thoughts that were going through your mind when those air balls came raining down on the Delta Center? Okay. <laughs> I took the first one. Mm -hmm. It felt good. It did. It felt good. It felt good. And it went short. I just said, damn, I'm going to make the next one. And the next one, damn, I'm going to make the next one because these feel good. Right. Then I shoot the next one. I said, damn, okay, I'm due. Mm. <laughs> All right. And then I shot two more. 24 hours a day. We're AFKF. It's game five of the best of seven Western Conference semifinal. The Los Angeles Lakers and the Utah Jazz. Utah hosting the Los Angeles Lakers. L.A. bigger than Utah in every position. In fact, Shaquille O'Neal has 20. Combination of Stockton and Jeff Hornacek with Carl Malone, Greg Ostertag, and Brian Russell. Shaquille went and set a pick for him. Campbell just missed it. And Shaquille got it and made the best. Then XO and Stockton have to make a quick move. Here goes Malone. Knocked away by Eddie Jones. What a great defensive play. And 20 seconds to shoot a clean. Utah, two of their first four. Campbell, oh, he oh. kept it by Ostertag and knocked the Hornacek. And a foul. They have a better chance to go all the way because of his ability down on the block. He comes from the weak side on that one. It may Utah, 33%. Campbell and Malone, one-on-one. -on -one. And even just a slender on one. But the two, oh, that's just a great one defense. Ori to O'Neal. Oh, and he gets Dosa Tag with his second block tonight. Here comes Stockton, three on one, to Malone! Campbell, but he does a great job anticipating Shaquille O'Neal and gets a hammer on that one. They like the way things can go when the big fella in the middle can play. Dosa Tag has had an effect, but you can't forget about Malone. He'll deliver. <laughs> Gotta go right here. Percy cannot handle Malone. Then to shoot. They don't double-team Carl as he's outside the lane and putting in his seventh point tonight. Yeah, there are too many things he can do. It's Wisely and Van Exel, Ostertag and Campbell, Malone and Kersey. And look at Van Exel swirl for two. Yeah, Nick's going to come and try to take him in, and that Carl just told him, keep him in front of him. Nick Van Exel keeps his dribble here. A bad job defensively, I thought, by Ostertag and Malone. Jones looking out of the corner of his eye, but Malone, with seven on the shot clock, snaps it back to Russell, who hits Isley for three. Makes it for my team. I'm embarrassed about how I play. That's why I wanted to come back and have a good showing. Van Exel ends with an ice. Defensively, he's not quick enough to stay with Eddie Jones. Isley, what a pass to Malone! Fundamental. Yet they trail by seven. Campbell, one and one with Ostertag. A big man shouldn't ever want a guard to pick him. Never let a guard pick him. Kobe Bryant in the game, the 18-year-old. Van Exel. So a little switch now defensively for the Jazz. Bryant into Hornacek. Plays by Greg Ostertag with O'Neal out. Ostertag thriving, and you can see where he ranks among playoff participants. He had four blocks in the first quarter alone. Well, he was active, anticipating where to get, trying to get the crowd involved. Here comes Stockton, whose head swivels as he surveys and takes into the defense of Van Exel and finds Malone. Working on Rooks, Carl Malone. Hard head in hand, died on the play, instead of staying aggressive. Stockton after the bump, got the bumper he needed for six again. Malone with 17, it's 35-29, the Jazz. Anderson got up so high, I think, before Kobe Bryant could realize it, he, he had his arms up and he pushed the legs of the ball. He's got 13. O'Neal with a couple of fouls. Works out. Foster just goes inside with him to be aggressive on both sides of the ball. And it's a three-point game with 6.45 in the first half. Stockton around the Ostertag oh. screen. And then the three. Oh, no. 
The double woman, it's out to Ori, swinging it out to Jones, inside to Campbell, over Ostertag, tapped in by O'Neal. Cleaned up nicely. You see, Russell is guarding, and Ostertag comes over, and then no one blocked out Shaquille O'Neal, who's there, able to put it down. Nobody's got Brian Russell. They'll take the three. Nobody had it. He came down wide open enough experience, but this is a tough way to be put in. But he had 19. He had 19 in game three. Always be poised. Shot oh, six. Oh, 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 I mean, I saw him set him up. Derek Fisher is not paying attention on this. And, and the reason that they find themselves in this position. Campbell's been quiet. One of seven. One of eight. Oh, there goes O'Neal. And it was the same kind of play. Ostertag came and helped out. Shaquille gets it on the weak side. They just and five block shots in the first half. What is it? The gamble for the play in the first half. O'Neal, there's that repost you're talking about, but this time Brian takes it. O'Neal got a hand on it, taps it to Dan Axel. Ball is deflected, picked up by Bryant, goes behind his back and keeps it alive for Los Angeles. They will need Robin down the stretch somewhere along the line. Bryant to O'Neal, and he's had to have to score against a double team. Makes a big difference. Oh, oh the split just makes a big difference. Russell for three with four tenths of a second remaining, and that sends Utah to the locker room. Well, Lakers now within a five-point reach. Russell, Good. what a shot by Russell. What a tough shot, because I'm telling you, Robert Orr can't play him any better. Be like Mike. Here comes one shot. Tell him to get in line if he wants to be like Mike. <laughs> Arl Malone from 24. Oh, what a shot by Malone. He's got 21. That was a determined Carl Malone there. Six-point game, 9-20 in the third. Hornacek maneuvering on Ori after shedding Joe. Oh, oh, oh! oh spectacular shot. This is a great shot. This is with one arm he is being held by Robert Ory, and he knew it all along. And just watch. This is, he goes back. Watch his left arm. It's held. It's held behind his back. I could beat you with my hand behind my back. <laughs> What a great shot. That was a beauty. Eight-point game. And Hornacek completes the leg. It's back well on defense. Yeah, but I thought Campbell got fouled on that, and so did he, so he tried to... Oh! O'Neal just close lines Malone. That's a flagrant. Flagrant foul. And Carl Malone is letting him know that that foul wasn't warranted. But that may be what the Lakers need, and they just call the technical on Carl Malone. No, oh, it's oh, like glory! The Fisher's got to get control of this one. They, did they just throw Ori out? They just threw Ori out of the game. And Malone better watch out. And Robert Ori is gone. What a bad, bad sequence of events for the Lakers because part of it was relatively decent. I hear O'Neal. What you see here and what Carl is mad about because he gets racked. There's no doubt about it. And he goes down hard. And I, he may have a little sore neck after that one. But then on the left side, Ori takes a shot there. And you see right there, Hugh Evans looking right at him and on the spot. And from there, all you got to do is... Here this team goes from this point. I would tend to say this one, the way the circumstances came out, the benefit of the doubt starts to go to the, to the Jazz. I mean, because they, it didn't... Nothing they really did from, from this perspective warranted that kind of the role. They didn't... And here the miss was inside, doubled by O'Neal, out to Hornacek. Shot clock at four, knocked away by Van Exel, picked up by Hornacek, Stockton for three! Oh my goodness! What a shot! What a shot! Three seconds on the shot clock after three, two. Rebound him. It's about as tenacious as we've seen that, and then it's followed in the shot clock at four. Stockton, another desperation shot, this time it won't go. Look at the hustle of Ostertag uh, with the little Dennis Rodman to boot. For the Jazz. So see the screen, single coverage Isley on Van Exel. Out to Kobe Bryant. Point game at the end of three, 66-61. With the Lakers, Chris Hamble out to Van Exel. And to Bryant, thought about Stop. three, and here he comes inside, colliding with Parr in a Anderson guarding Bryant, a nice array of moves by Kobe Bryant with a big-time hit. Oh, I told you, he can play. You, you were talking about a young kid. He can get going offensively, man. It is a two-point game. 
Watch this little shake and bake. Yeah, well, he gets Shannon Anderson started back, and Anderson comes back and tries to get to the shot. By the time he gets there, it's too late. And Anderson can defend. He can defend, but this young man can get to the basket, has complete confidence. LA's only lead was in the first quarter, 10 to 9. Van Exel for the lead. Lakers and DeMar working out on the You're right, they go right at him. Now here's Stockton outside, seven to shoot, and down the lane. Both is swatted by O'Neal and counted for two. Utah back on top by one. Yeah, you got to position yourself. Shaquille goes over, and is clearly coming down. He throws it into the stands, but you don't want to do that one, not now. See, that's okay early when you want Bryant to. Bryant bringing down the ball. The next one on the side is an off guard. Bryant stripped of it, out of bounds, off his knee, ricochets away. Utah's basketball. Yeah, it came off his leg. He, when you go in the paint like that, you've got to go with it stronger, and that's what he'll learn playing in the playoffs. This is a mismatch that's, that favors the Lakers because Kobe Bryant is quicker and is taller than John Stockton. And Stockton draws a personal foul. He's got three. 8 0 one to play. Yeah, that, that's one of the matchups the Lakers like to get to. Of the doubleheader in the special time. 7 o'clock Eastern. 7 o'clock Eastern. Game 5, Sonics and Rockets. And at 9.30 Eastern. Game 5, Hawks and Bull. The NBA Vince Cellini will host that. 7 o'clock Eastern tomorrow night. Doubleheader NBA playoff action. And you're on TNT. The one injection. Tough shot. There was absolutely no way to Lakers by a three-point deficit. Oh, what a the young fellow. Nick Van Exel has a chance to tie it at the free throw line. I thought he'd come out and try to play a game to get everybody back on his side, but watch the quickness. Explodes to the basket, gets there, and Carr comes a little late. Nick takes the contact and gets it high off the glass with a little English. Hold a sec. Nice lead to an open car. What a pass to Malone. What a great play by Carr. If Malone was killed for oh. Shot clock at nine. Jerome Kersey with the reverse. Oh, he got it to fall. Jerome what a Kersey play by to do. Now watch. He takes it and does a 360 and, and gets it up soft enough to get it in. Four minutes to play. Regulation. Lakers by one. Facing elimination. Stockton for the lead. Oh, Neil. Ah, that's a bad decision. We both. Back in, drawing three, and he puts it down! And O'Neal with the jam, and the Lakers win. So, seven to shoot, which is what Stockton does. O'Neal and Ostertag battling for position, quickly double, but what a pass inside to Bryant! And O'Neal comes up with another great feed. Good read and the ability to get up and finish by Bryant. Stockton to bring it to a one point. Campbell coming out. Russell inside for the tie. Oh, oh, oh. Goodness. He's shot by Brian Russell. He's got 20. Utah ties it with 113 to play. To Malone, shot clock at eight. He's got it. Stocked in the top. That help was high. With the win. On the drive. Oh. Rejected by Oster Tag. He's got nine. None bigger than that. We're tied at 89. They'll still get another shot at it, though. They've got Carl Malone being guarded by Jerome Percy. They, they'll go down to that. It's Carl Malone. Seven to shoot. For the lead. Oster Tag's underneath that. He's got the rebound. Picked up by Van Exel. Timeout Los Angeles. They, burn they the feel confident in this position. This is a tough matchup. Kobe Bryant will take it. A 18-year-old rookie, short. No time remains. But, the, but again, and there's Kobe Bryant with the chance to win it. Well, he, he gets the move. I mean, this is pretty good defense. But look, he takes the shot and he shoots it short. But I've got to say this for an 18. An excellent thought about a three maneuvers by Stockton feeds to a wide open Kobe Bryant. Boy, that, I tell you what. Stop it. Malone. He's got 30 points and 20 rebounds. And Axel out to Campbell. Brian, deep, big time three, and he can't hit it. Rebound by Eddie.
Well, things have gone against the Lakers. They trailed by 13 in the third, came back to tie, and in fact, take a three-point lead. Kobe Bryant right against the glass and down. Along working on Campbell. And the fadeaway. Oh, what a tough shot. And, roll and trying to get to the hole. A lot of time, a lot of possessions left. See, that's, that's a good thing, because he can go with a number of people, but the one thing that... Was out, following out, or he was ejected in the third. And this is what this team's got to play with. Byron Scott injured, has not played. Bryant for the tie. So with it. He's got a chance if it gets close to foul. Bryant for the tie. Another air ball. Well, I stopped momentarily because you feel for Kobe Bryant for what he was trying to do. It probably is going to be closer to five seconds. But Carl Malone tried to take the ball out without the officials touching it, which it cannot do. Neil O'Neill was out. 28 of those guys. It goes 16 and 12 with him out. So they have a chance to do something pretty good considering that they are a young Kobe Bryant. Yeah, this is one that Kobe's got to figure out. And players do this pretty well. Kobe Bryant's dead. Jelly Bryant, they call him Jelly Bean, Joe Bryant. Play. Yeah, they deserve to go. They're, they're the team with the best record in the Western Conference. You don't win. And the one game is the last game of the season you play Utah. Yeah. The one where you shoot three air balls at the end. Five. It's like five. And then you it's hit crazy. one and his them doesn't go in, right? Mm -hmm. Moses, not Malone, one of the Malones came and spoke to you. I don't know who it was from the Jazz. Malone, he was, yeah. He was saying something. You yeah. were not even paying attention. Shaq was whispering something in your ear. What did Shaq say to you in that moment? I don't even know. You don't remember? No, I wasn't paying attention. Got you know, like, like it, it was, you know, like for me, it, it's maybe it's a little like asshole of me or whatever, but whatever. Um, he was like, he was trying to whisper encouraging things. I was like, I'm fucking fine. <laughs> okay. I shot five air balls on national TV in front of millions of people that cost us the series. And I'm 18. I'm fine, dude. 